So we're at Brian's shop today, and it's a, it's a garage day for SLR. And we're going to start by putting some uh, special carriers manufacturing suspension components on my machine, and I'll show you why. So right now, I'm at 17 inches of clearance on the back. Here's the, here's the problem. Look at my trailing arms. 13 and 3 quarters inches. So I got 4 inches of lost suspension travel because the factory A-arms are so big. So we asked Clint to fix that for us and we're going to see what he sent us. Let's see what Clint sent us here. Watch out, buddy. Yeah, I have a hard time unboxing. That would have been great if you had fallen there. Look at that packing job, man. Some other companies don't do that. They just ship them and they come all beat up. Uh, but Brian, I'm fixing to make a mess in your shop, just so we're clear. Merry Christmas. Look at that. Straight beef. You're going to need some help getting those out. I'm going to need some help getting them open. My God. Yeah. They yeah. are, uh, yeah. it's like, oh, yeah. 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 Lay them back down here. One <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that's how you pack stuff right there, y'all. Get those welds. They look great. Yeah, they sure do. Welds on the inside. All right, we are about to install the new special carriers manufacturing trailing arms and radius rods. Man, it's my hand for scale. These things Actually, are huge. That powder coat is beautiful. What do you mean? And look at the size of those spacers, man. That's like trailing oh, arm size that. spacers. Yeah. You ain't been in these things. <laughs> Come on, Chris, go faster. I'm not NASCAR. You don't have to put the lug nuts down every time just i gotta get them out of the key there slick see jeez oh shut up see this is how it's done right here uh, okay I'm, I'm prepared oh look at that it's stuck, it's stuck in the key it's like it's like i don't know maybe i'm not a dumbass <laughs> Hey, look, he's holding him in his hand. We need to put a timer up on there. Oh my God. Sonny versus Chris. Is this my uh, key right here, Chris? Yes. Okay. Next thing we're doing is we're taking off the castle nut on the axle, uh, taking off the brake caliper, and we are going to loosen the knuckle and get everything ready to install the new trailing arms. Next step, take off the old radius right come on baby this might be a good time to mention the uh, bungs that james shelley exactly sells needs to be gone is it i can i can hold it and take it off i'm just trying to keep it from flying off you know <laughs> so, the bolts that 
the OEM bolts that come with this thing are not long enough. So there's your uh, that goes on the special OEM carriers bolt. includes four new bolts and nuts. Hold it further. God, out. look at those spacers, man. <laughs> Compared to the other ones, that other company. <laughs> yeah, they're pretty stout. Trying to not push. Is it going? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I think. It felt like it was. I want. Let me see. Surely it can't be. No, it didn't. Oh no, I see it. Yeah. Back it back out. I can't tell where. Well, it looks like you're too far this way. Yeah, you are. I need to come back to you. Whoop. Whoop. <laughs> Here, if you can hold that, I'll get it. Okay. Backwards, is it? No. All right. Again, this is another opportunity to promote James bongs that weld in that make this a whole lot easier. You're gonna have to move. Yeah, that's okay. it. All right, when you take these off, you gotta make sure that you adjust the himes that they're the exact same length as the factory. So Chris was basically taking a tape measure from the center of the heim to the this top one. bolt. Yeah, the this top one. bolt. Uh, and then doing the same thing on the OEMs and adjusting the home, screwing those out. Uh, Are these 41 like? Uh, 41. Okay. Yeah. From the center, oops, from the center. The center of the hole, hole to center of the hole. Yep. And on the top one here, 41. Okay. And do lock that those. Yeah, they're, they're locked that. Same thing on the uh, radius rods. You've got the adjustable himes here where you can adjust the length on these. Do the same thing with the factories. Mm -hmm. Those are obviously not adjustable. Uh, so the good thing about these is you can adjust your rear camber uh, on your tires. Whereas the factory, you're locked in. To, uh, you can't adjust it. These you can adjust upper and lower. Some companies will just do the upper, and the lower is fixed. But Clint's special carriers is both of them are adjustable. So that's another nice feature to have. And if you look at these, there's no way you're gonna bend these. These will never bend. The factories get bent up like toothpicks. And if you do bend them, lifetime warranty. Yep, exactly. One. Ready? Yeah. Can you can that way, buddy. It's, it's twisted, Brian. You're gonna have to square. There you go. There you go. All right. All right. Chris's, what? Chris's skid plate is making this a little bit more difficult than it should be. But. There you go. There you go. Now we just gotta get it down on the other end. 
No, At least they go in there that easy. Well, they fit good, don't they? Remember how, how we had oh, to fight yeah. them up on the day? Yeah. Right there. Golly. Isn't that a thing of beauty? And it looks like it's even straight. Don't forget, we gotta route that correctly when we put that shock on. Yeah. Woo! Small victories. We'll take them. I love right there where it says SCM. That is super cool, man. That is nice. Super cool. Man. Fast! I don't know if we tightened anything. But <laughs> you fixing to see a much bigger number than you had, big boy. Because it's o over half the tire is clearance. Oh, so good, man. You recording? Yes, sir. What's we the number? We went from 13 and a half inches at the, at the shock bolt to 16 and a half. Nice. Three inches. Three more inches. <laughs> Yeah, I didn't want to rest a minute. It's all right. I'm all right. I got this. Those even look, those, I got real good clearance with them radio strides, too. That is beautiful. <laughs> the, only thing, the only thing is they drop down quicker than most. Right those here. things are amazing. Yeah, I really, those. really like those. Yeah, it's just about it is That looks good. It really does. So, it certainly looks beefy. That, uh... That suspension is beefed up, I will say. <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> Said Sarah. Yeah, she is stout. Yeah. I mean, look at the clearance on there, dude. <coughs> All right, so it's time for an upgrade. We are taking these mm. junk A arms off and putting these beautiful, beefy. Special carriers manufacturing a arms on the machine. Uh, I have replaced the driver's side twice. Last trip to Winrock, I uh, bent it again. These are junk. Uh, you can see it's bent here. The first time I replaced it, I put an OEM back in it just because I was in a pinch and I needed one like overnight. My dealer got it because we were leaving for a trip. So I put an OEM back on there thinking maybe it was just. Uh, a bad a arm or something that it would hold up well obviously it didn't chris uh you may have seen that on facebook or the video that he made he literally bent his in a 90 degree angle both of them at winrock on 22 and he wasn't even doing anything we weren't cranking on it we weren't winching on it or nothing they're weak they are junk these things right here are probably twice as heavy and they are just beef and they're beautiful the powder coat matches perfect um, I mean, look at these welds. I mean, these things are just incredible. Special Carriers Manufacturing, give them a call. We'll leave a link in the bottom of this video. We're going to do a build or a uh, install today. Uh, we're putting these on, but uh, just wanted to show y'all and tell y'all how crappy these are. If you got a Turbo S, you need you need to redo these because they are junk. Um, and. Uh, Clint's gonna have uppers available soon, so yeah, you'll, you'll see those on both of our machine here. Pretty By the time you watch this video, they'll probably be available. There uh, will be two weeks is when they're gonna be ready, and they're gonna be the same box style, which is really cool. I mean, not only do they, you know, extremely stronger, uh, lifetime warranty. If you do bend them, you won't. Um, but they look cool too. They look a lot better than this junk. But anyway, we're gonna get started on it and. Uh, a little bit of the process of how how they go on it's pretty easy but uh i'm ready to get this crap off quick important note is these special carrier all the a arms and uh, radius rods and everything come with uh side by side performance bushings already installed it's quality quality yep. stuff lifetime on these two yep. uh that's another thing that's junk on these well, yep yeah. 
after Sonny and I both had, got our S's around the same time, we both had basically the same trips and the same mileage on our razors. And what would you say, at about 500 miles? Uh, probably a little before. Around four or 500 miles, I mean, the front end was just just rattling. It was so bad with the stock bushings, the mm -hmm. junk. And it just got so bad, like we thought the front end was gonna come off. So we replaced them, uh, put some uh, performance bushings in them, and they've been incredible. I mean, it's been yep. a thousand miles or so, and they it's like they won as far as how firm the front end is. So, uh, but anyway, they come standard free in special carrier stuff. Do it, do it. We all have the same shirt on, how cute. I know. Well, you're the Isn't that special? Mm -hmm. Exactly. That's our new name, the A-Team. The A-Team. All right, get her. Let's see how those fit. Wow, hold on, Sonny, come over here. Tell me when you're ready. Look at this, okay? Ahead, what? Would you look at it? Look, no, seriously, look at that. Okay, mm -hmm. they just slid on there. Um, They're in. Now I just gotta get the bolt in. Perfectly. Go ahead, oh, up just a little bit. You're almost there. Yep, there we go. It's amazing. A-arms that fit properly. Wow. Would you oh. look at it? Woohoo, new A-arms. More special carriers. Special carriers manufacturing, baby. Bolt. Straight There you go. Bolt, 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 bolt. Mm. It is amazing how well that fit. Just get it in that hole there. Can you find the hole? <laughs> Easy, Chris. You are alive, bro. <laughs> All right. Bang, bang, boom. Didn't have to bend nothing. Didn't have to use any extra. Yeah, parts. it's amazing. Uh, What's that? They fit. So they actually fit. You buy a product from somebody, an aftermarket product, you put it on there. And it, it fits. fits perfectly. Special carriers. That's crazy.